Today we're going undetected in a scam call center. This is me, but you're hearing it from a scammer's point of view. No, honey, this is my this is my cell. A lot of scammers watch these videos, so we're not going to tell you exactly how we gain access to their systems. But just like any good scam baiter, once we find a vulnerability to a call center, we're going to invite ourselves in. Now these scammers are pretending to be Geek Squad. They send emails of fake charges to lure people in. Now these are real scammers, real victims, and these calls are happening live. Listen, I, I just want to cancel. I'm not filling out any more forms. I didn't fill out a form to, to order this. So everyone, what we're really trying to do is we're trying to stop these guys from connecting to these innocent people's computers. Because once they have access, they're screenshotting and documenting all their personal information, and they've got it forever. We don't want the scammers knowing that we're on their systems, so this is pure stealth mode. Let's get into it. This is Daniel Ward. How can I assist you? Hi, Daniel. Um, this is Betty Allen. There's a gentleman, Alex, that was on my computer, and I've called him back. I'm on my chase. Oh, uh, please uh, open it any desk. Okay. And then what? All right. What I'm going to do, ma'am, first of all, uh, there, is some, there is some kind of uh, interruption from your end. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to give you a call from my end, okay? Okay. So he's on my computer right now. I'm actually browsing through his um, files really quickly. I'm actually going to see if there's any interesting information to get so you guys can see it. There's a lot going on um, at the moment. So as you can see, he's like doing stuff to my screen. See, he's doing this little file stuff right now. So let's see if there's anything else we want to get really quickly. Their internet's really bad. Desktop, let's see if there's any files. This is always the first thing that I do when I get on here. Um, let's see if there's anything that's like worthwhile. We'll get these. We'll download this one. This is probably old. We'll download some of these notes just to see if there's like anything interesting. Um, you can see their kind of typical stuff that they have. Um, nothing too crazy here. All right, he's calling me. I'm calling him back. And then we'll show you guys the screen in just a second. Ma'am, somebody has put some virus on your system. Who is okay? Bruce? Who's Bruce Williams? Bruce Williams, uh, his uh, investigation officer for your case, who's going to investigate, like, who's the person who just stolen your information. Okay, and within a few moments, I'm going to connect you to Mr. Bruce William, who is going to guide you the protocols that you can get the refund and as well as they will going to uh, save your information, whatever the information those people they have stolen from you. Within a few moments, I'm going to give a, I'm going to get connected to Mr. Bruce William. All right. Okay, so I just well, I thought I was receiving my money back. Right now, those people, they have got into your network, okay? Oh, God. Those people, they got into your network. Don't worry, ma'am. Okay. We have a best security team, okay? And okay. I'm going to transfer I'm going to transfer this case to the uh, investigation officer from the Federal Trade Commission, okay? So... We're on their computer still. Uh, I'm listening to a live victim. Hold on. Uh, oh, no. Message on my phone from the Geek Squad. And uh, it's an this? unauthorized purchase. $389.99. $389.99. For Geek Squad Best Buy service. I'm going to get this lady. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save this lady. She's she's on the phone with the scammer that I'm on his computer. So his information, like, hold on. I'm going to call her. I'm going to call her up right now. I've got her information. I'm going to hit her up right now. While I was scam baiting and monitoring the scammer at the same time, I ran across a victim's phone number, so I decided to contact her. The crazy thing, guys, is that the scammer just took her phone number and went to the internet to find more information on her that he could use against her. This is an example as to why we partnered with Aura today in order to keep your most personal information safe. Just like me, I'm sure you guys do a lot of things online, and that's why scammers and hackers are doing everything that they can in order to get your information. 
Aura is an identity theft protection, fraud monitoring, AV, and password manager all wrapped in one app. They will monitor the dark web daily for personal information like email addresses, passwords, bank accounts, or even social security numbers. With identity theft being such a common theme in our lives every day, new victims are found every 14 seconds with an average loss of around $1,000. Aura is able to notify you when they are alerted on any of your personal information on the dark web so that you can take the proper action needed. I've seen my information on the dark web before, so I think it's safe to say that you need to protect yourself as well. Go to Aura.com payback for a free two-week trial and see what kind of information they might find of yours. Now, let's get into the call that we had with the victim. My, my first name is Margaret, and my last name is... One moment, please. Come on, There's pick a up. call coming in, and... I, and uh, pick up, pick up. One moment, please. Yes. She's like, there's a call coming in. Can you hold on a minute, please? Would you mind holding? I, I can hear her. I'm, this So what's happening? I can hear her through the scammer's computer, and she's talking about me calling her. So these headphones, I'm, I, I can hear her, and I'm trying to call her through my other headphones. She's not picking up. Pick up. Hello? Hi, ma'am. Hey, you're on the phone with scammers right now. I just want to let you know. I'm watching, I'm watching their computer, and I heard them talking to you. Uh, it was Geek Squad, right? Yes. Yeah, I, I, they sent you an email, didn't they? Yes, they sent me an email, and, and I got a charge. Yeah, there's uh, no charge. I promise you. I'm on their computer right now, and I okay. heard them talking to you. That's because you kept going like, "Hey, hold on, hold on one second. I'm like calling you a bunch of times, and yes. you kept, I could hear you telling them. So I was like, "Oh, okay. please pick up." So yeah, okay. What I'll do, because uh, I don't know if this is a legitimate charge or not. No, I'll just go to no, the no, no, hold on. There's no charge. So what happens is they email you, and they make it look oh. like it's like Geek Squad or Best Buy, and there's no, right. there's zero charge. What they were going to do is they were going to connect to your computer or your phone. And then they were going to um, mess with your computer and make your browser look like they gave you all this extra money and, or else they were just going to steal money out of your account. Got so, you. Yeah. Okay. I okay. thank you. You if have you a need, good day. If you need anything, you can call me, but seriously, do not talk to these guys. I'm still watching okay. them. Just, they're going to call you a bunch. Just don't, okay. <laughs> don't talk with well, them. So I, I appreciate the heads up and I'll just go ahead and hang up with both with him. Okay. Perfect. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. Bye. Right, bye. Bye. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. This okay. is Betty. Mom, I think you got disconnected. Yeah. Well, I somebody. Yeah, I did get, get disconnected. I had to go help somebody real quick. So, can you please let me know, like, uh, right now, apart from me, is there anyone else who like? Let's who go. Talking to? Let's go. Hello. Well, Hello. I was talking with a gentleman from the Best Buy Hello. Geek Squad. And then I was also yeah. talking with someone from oh, yeah. from the FTC. Okay, sir, I have to get going. Uh, my my dog is there's somebody out there, and I can't talk right now. I'll call back later. Thank you. Bye bye. Okay. All right. So let me tell you right now. You are talking to Geek Squad. Okay, the Best Buy Geek Squad. Okay. And again, I'm and again, I'm going to transfer your case to the Federal again? Trade Commission to the FTC. Yeah. Okay. Because, ma'am, there are some intruders who get into your network and they just try to steal. Well, some how do we know they're not on your network? Okay, because, ma'am, we have a secure server. Okay, and let me show you, like, uh, the intruders who are in your whom, uh, who are they in your network? Okay. Can you see there's a black windows on your screen? Yeah, I see that. Okay. So I'm going to give you a command over there and it will show us like exactly how many foreign people, the foreign intruders, or we can see the hackers who are into your system right now, who are in your network. Okay. So as I hit enter, you will see the scan has started over there. I see a scam yeah. that's running. How long does the scam run for? This is not a scam, ma'am. This is a scam. scam. Okay. How long does the yeah. scam run for? I didn't get that, ma'am. How? Long yes, I can hear you. Does the scan run for? This is not a scan, ma'am. This is scan. S-C-A-N. Scan. -E scan. Yeah, the scan will be run for like about two to three minutes. Okay. Oh, okay. Well. Well, I got an email from Geek Squad that you're going to review a prescription for three hundred. Dollars, and I don't even—I've never had this. This must not apply to me. 
We got a lady. She's saying she's never used Geek Squad. I'm listening in on this. I am an 88 year old woman, and, and it would have to be somebody outside of anyone knows. Yeah. The first one it says that. Oh, great. She's 88 uh, years ID old. Compromise. Oh no, no, I, I, this, I, no, this doesn't sound right. This does not sound right. This is a renewal. This is a, an invoice number and all this kind of stuff. I never dealt with this. I, I don't believe this is fine. Something's wrong here. That Target Finance Institute. Oh, she's she's doing see? good. She's like, I don't. This is. I just highlighted. She's like, I don't know why I'm giving you this information. This is a scam. Hello. Yes. The intruders. They are established on your network, and they're stealing the data out of your device, and your bank accounts are also like compromised. Okay. So okay. the government is going to take care of that for you. And the officer's name is Grace Thomas. Okay. She's going to take care of this case for you. So she's going to call you in about two minutes. Just make sure you answer the call. Okay, honey. Thank you. I'm, I'm going to hang up. Yeah, for sure. No problem. That's my duty. I'm going to hang up and she's going to call you up. She's the officer from the Federal Trade Commission and her name is Grace Thomas. Okay, All right? honey. Okay. Okay, bye. All right. So right now she's, you here? So I'm trying to get where the, her phone number shows up. They're going to do a reverse lookup. Oh, here, I got her number. No, go back, you idiot. Put the number in. All right, I got, I'm getting the number. Okay, I got her number. I got her number. I'm calling her up right now. I'm calling her up. I'm calling her up. I'm calling her up. I'm calling her up. Let's go. Let's freaking go. I'm going to call her a hundred times if I have to. She's 88 freaking years old, you guys. 88 years old. She's 88 freaking years old. Come on. Come on, ma'am. Please pick up. Come on. Hi, ma'am. Hi. Um, I just want to let you know right now you're on the phone with scammers. I know I was listening to that conversation. Um, yes. You should hang up with them. You're doing a really good job. You're very skeptical of them. Those are 100% scammers. They're going to try to connect to your computer and steal your money. Yeah. So I, I, this has got to be dealt with. I, I, I because know. Because I do not owe you three hundred. No, 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 ma'am. Ma'am, I, I promise you, I'm watching these scammers. They're talking to you on the phone. They're trying to steal your money. Oh, so there, oh, there's. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying to me now. Okay. Yes, ma'am. There is no charge, I promise you. Okay? So I, I don't have to worry about this? Yes, ma'am. You do not have to worry about it. I promise you. <laughs> it's a 100% it's a, a scam. These guys are scammers based out in India, and we're watching them, and we're trying to fight back against them so, you know, so innocent people don't get scammed and lose everything. So... I, I don't need to call my bank to tell them not to pay that. Um, there, so it's all there's no there's actually zero payment that's even happened. If you want to feel comfortable, you can call your bank and you can talk with them about it and say, "Hey, I got this really weird call." You can go talk with them, but there will be no charge on there. I promise you. Uh, oh, now that I'm getting another call back from from the the people yeah, that's, that the one two zero two number. Yeah, those are the scammers trying to get back in contact. They're going to call you a bunch of times. So I would just not pick up for right now. I know it sounds really crazy, but I just, I didn't want you to get scammed by these really bad criminals. Okay. Uh, if I call this number back, you would be able to answer it, right? Uh, this one that I called you from, the 910, you can call me at this number anytime you want. I no, she just hung up. She's like, Woo, go baby. Let's go. 389.99. Oh, I've got another one, too, on here. Listen, I, I just want to cancel. I'm not filling out any more forms. I didn't fill out a form to, to order this. Pissed. He's like, I just want to cancel. I hear him. I hear him. Well, then send me the form, and I will fill it out. Oh, this guy's like, send me the form. Come on, guy. I'm going to get his phone number. See, they don't know what's going on because they, that's me. Yeah, it's blocked, though. You can't see. Yeah. Well, hold on. Oh, he's right here, right here. Yeah. <laughs> Him. Yep, I'm calling him. Okay, we're going to call this guy up a million times now, too. But this guy doesn't know what's going on because he's like, something is weird about this thing that's this any desk connection. He's not talking Hello. at all. Hey, right sir, um, I just wanted to call you just to verify. I know you're on the phone with some internet scammers. I heard that conversation. Yeah. Um, so I just wanted to call and, you know, you're probably a little freaked out by these guys. So your intuition yeah, was yeah. correct. So, yeah, and you sounded very pissed. I'll be honest. You sounded very pissed with them. 
So I just want to let you know that the, it was 100% a scam. So there's no charge or anything yeah. like that. They were going to try to take all your money. Exactly. That that I was, I was just I, I just hung up on the son of a bitch. So <laughs> that that's exactly what I I, I thought it was. So for sure. For I sure. appreciate I appreciate the heads up. Yeah. No. I, I was I was like I said I go this guy is going to be so pissed when because I'm going to call him so much until he picks up. <laughs> so I yeah, knew you were already I, I, pissed I, I, with them. But anyway. Okay, cool. Well, thank you very much for the heads up. I appreciate it. Yeah, just want to let you know, if you ever have any questions, you can call me. Appreciate that. Right. Thank you, sir. Right, thanks. Be good. Bye-bye. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Big shout out to all the members of the fight who support Scammer Payback. Our biggest project to date is the People's Call Center, and that video is releasing on the 20th. If you want to see exclusive behind-the-scenes content and interviews, become a member today by hitting the join button below. This is Pierogi saying, don't get scammed.